Hi, Edwin Mayatelo here. Uh, today's topic is why you should not give up on your dreams. Okay. Uh, really, why should you not give up on your dreams? Uh, because, listen, a lot of people don't understand that actually a dream or a vision is actually a living thing. Okay. It is a living thing. Uh, a dream is actually comparable to a, to a baby. See, when you have a baby, if you can, you can think very carefully about uh, a baby, then and, 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 and compare it very well with, uh, with a vision, you understand why you should not never give up on your dream, right? Because when you have a baby, right, how many times do you, do you, do you, do you check that baby? Probably a thousand times in a, in a day. Let's say the baby just born, to, born was born today, right? You keep on checking on that probably a thousand times. Literally, maybe sometimes your eyes don't go, even move off the baby. Your eyes are always like this on the baby, right? <laughs> right? So, why? Because you care for the baby. So, the same thing with the vision. You've got to care for the baby, right? Uh, and you also make sure that the baby is fed. The same thing with the vision. You got to make sure your vision is fed. And how do you do that for the vision? You make sure that uh, you 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 do the things that that actually will motivate you. That will instill that vision. That will uh, push that that vision forward. Right? It's fed on a daily basis, right? So how many how 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 many times should you see your vision? Well, I was thinking the same way. That's the same question you ask if you have the baby. How many times would you would you see the baby? Right. So a vision is a living thing. It actually uh, uh, grows, and and it actually um, there's a time where it really manifests itself, right? And the whole world can see, right? And when it manifests itself, it's so beautiful, it's so wonderful. You like. So what was the problem here? So it's important that you understand that the vision is exactly like your baby. You've got to check it all the time. Uh, you can't leave it at home. You've got to carry it all the, all the time. It's the same thing, if you can't leave your baby. Imagine you had, you are a parent, right? And you forget your baby at home. And then you go somewhere, you realize you've forgotten the baby. You start riding back home, right? <laughs> That's crazy. You just can't do it, right? You just cannot do that. And uh, you see, I, I know we are coming towards the end of the year now. And people in general will be saying, I'm starting a vision, right? I'm, I want to write my vision down. This really that thing, you only, if, if you are serious enough about your vision, you should have a vision written uh, almost on a daily basis, right? So it doesn't have to be January. January, maybe if you've never done it before, of course, you have to start somewhere, but once you have started, it should be non-stop. You just continue uh, writing that vision down. So that's why I really you should never, never quit on your uh, on your vision or quit on your dreams, right? Because you can't quit on the baby. Imagine quitting on the baby, just leaving, the, dumping the baby, and, and, and just going away, right? That's irresponsibility of the worst kind. You cannot dump on your baby. Uh, you got to take care of that baby because you never know. Maybe that baby. Will be the next president, right? That baby might be the greatest person that's going to change the world. You never know what, what children will do when they grow up, right? You look at them, they might look ordinary, but the truth of the matter is they are they are not ordinary. So your vision is like that. It's like that child, right? That you never know what they will be tomorrow. Uh, so never, never quit on your, on, your, on your dreams. Ah, hi, hi, Pastor Frida. How are you today? Nice to see you today. And uh, how is how is that part of your of your area? Here we are, we had a bit of rain. Sometimes you know I know we have rain this side and your side is not raining, although we are in the same city. <laughs> nice to see you. Uh, so yeah, so when you when when you have uh, a vision or when you have a dream, you can never never let it die on you. You can never never let it perish on you, right? Very very important. So. About five years ago, right, we started this dream of just reaching out to the world and helping them in their own businesses, right? But uh, the start of it was very, very difficult, right? 
So, and the story was so startling, right? That we decided that we are going to make a, a video of that, and we are going to make an audio of that, and we are going to make a, uh, a PDF of that. So <laughs> we've compiled all that, and my friend is going to be doing that video, the entire thing, just to show you why. Just to encourage you, maybe if you look at that story that took us from where we, we, we were up to where we are, maybe it can just encourage you, can inspire you in your own business, right, and take you to another level. So if that interests you, go ahead and click that link below this video or somewhere next to the video. Uh, just watch the entire thing, grab the video, grab the audio, and also grab the PDF. And hopefully it will help you or someone else in their own business. Thank you so much for listening to me today. And I'll talk to you again tomorrow. Thank you so much. And bye for now.